What's up runners, Coach Morgan here, and today you are gonna be following along with me. We're gonna go on a tempo run with a little bit of strength built in. So I hope you're ready and excited. It's gonna be 15 minutes long, so I know you guys can do this. But first, we wouldn't be the run experience if we didn't warm up first, so let's go ahead and get in a couple of drills first. I'm gonna start my watch so we can do a little countdown here. First things first, we're gonna get that heart rate going up with some dynamic drills. We're gonna be doing some high knees, really driving those knees up high, swinging those arms. And here we go, 15 seconds. Just kind of starting to feel that warm up heat here. Focusing on the breath. Driving those knees up a little higher, maybe a little quicker. And rest. We're just gonna walk it back for 15 seconds. Just trying to feel that breath coming in. And you guys, lucky you get a beautiful day here in San Francisco with us. Going back, his butt kicks another 15 seconds here. Bringing those knees up, or bringing those heels up all the way to kiss the butt. Swinging those arms. Still focusing on our breath there, and walk it back another 15 seconds. You wanna do a couple of drills here just to get warmed up, so, cause I don't want you guys going into this cold because we're gonna be going for a little bit of quicker times here today. And let's get some quick skips in here. Driving those knees up with a little bit of a pop at the bottom. Working on that propulsion, pushing off of that back leg. It's almost like a little bit of a march in here. Two, and one. Let's walk it back, let's go through that one more time and then we'll get to our run. I know how excited you guys are. Coach Nate's behind the camera here. He's really excited to uh, yeah, get, some, get some running today. All right, high knees going back one more time. Okay. Everybody's out today, guys, in San Francisco. It Maybe, is a day. It is a day. Maybe getting those knees up a little bit higher, a little bit quicker this time. It's a day for some strength and tempo. <laughs> and walk it back. Two more here. Stick with me. Just maybe kind of shake out those shoulders a little bit. Give a little side to side. Get ready to go and butt kicks. Trying to go a little faster this time. Really warm up those hamstrings. Stay nice and tall through the chest. Driving those elbows. And walk it back one more time. Going into those Last little quick skips here, we'll be on our way. Skips and here we go. See if we can drive that knee up a little bit higher. See if we can get a bigger pop off that back leg. Focus on driving those hips forward. And done. Let's do this workout guys. All right, so let's do a little brief explanation of this workout today. We are gonna be doing a one minute run, two, three, four, and five minute run. And in between each, we're gonna be doing a little strength workout. Don't worry, you're following along with me. I'll tell you what it is when we get there. Each of these runs should be at about a seven out of 10 effort. So we shouldn't be able to talk, but we really shouldn't be sprinting all out. The goal here is to hold that same pace that we're holding for the minute and using that to hold all the way for that five minute one at the end. So we don't wanna to go to out too hard on this one minute run because we got some more running to do afterwards. So, watches at the ready. Here we go guys, seven out of 10 effort for one minute and let's go. Using these first couple strides here to just find that press, making sure our shoulders are Nice and relaxed, but roll back. And we're driving those hips forward. And we're breathing. Go left. Woo! <laughs> Directions on the fly here, guys. 20 more seconds. Pulling over, 
We're getting down, we're gonna do 10 push-ups. Quick explanation here. Those push-ups, shoulders over top of the wrist. We're in a nice tight plank position here. When we drop down, we're gonna touch both our stomach and our hips. Our knees are gonna stay off the ground, elbows tight in back. So that's one, two, three, four. If you need to drop down on your knees, five, that is okay too as a modification. Six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. Brush yourself off. We got a two minute run right here. All right. Trying to keep that same pace that we just held. We got this. We got this. Extra motivation from Nate behind the He's doing this too. Oh no. <laughs> Gotta avoid dogs. Dogs to dogs. Going down. the best views for you guys. Let's go to the bridge, Morgan. Yeah, it's not that far away, right? Be able to make it. Driving those elbows back behind you, staying nice and tall. Wanna make sure our form is good now so we can try to hold it, especially when we're getting real tired towards the end. Coming down here, deep breath, and we're gonna do 10 squat jumps. So with these, making sure we're sitting those hips back when we go down to that squat, keeping those knees behind the toes. So when I drop down, they're not over top of the toes. Drop down, touching the ground, big jump up, two. Six, we're doing 10 of these. Nine, big jump off the ground, and 10. Three minute run, right here. Here we go. Oh, as you turn the corner, imagine you're getting that nice cool breeze coming off the bay here. Keep your head in the game, stay focused. Keep breathing. This breeze feels awesome. Oh my god.
keep swinging the elbows, keep those shoulders relaxed. One more minute. Give me 10 burpees. Elbows are gonna stay close to the side just like we did when we did our push-ups. And just like when we were doing our squat jumps, we're sitting those hips back, snapping them up at the top. So jumping or stepping back, whatever you can do. Chest and hips are coming down to the ground just like our push-ups. Snapping those hips forward, jump leaving the ground at the top. Here for 10. Go Morgan, go. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine, one more. And 10. All right, right here, got a four minute run coming up, let's go. Straight right, Morgan. Oh, let's take a right. Sip out of that water. We'll loop around and go back to find Coach Holly. Come on, guys, keep it up right here. I know you're getting tired. Okay, keep moving. I'm here. <laughs> I'm right here. Right. Check it 
got those arms because it's hard to feel tight. Keep going. Got one minute left right here. Last run. Last five minute run this. right here. Let's do that. Woo Let's bounce over to the right side here so that we're abiding citizens.
press, guys. Come on, we got it. Final push right here. Let's go. A little over a minute. Let's go. I'm right here with you. to make sure that we're gonna cool down properly after this. As we cool it down, five minutes, Nate says. Take that time to really bring that heart rate down. Should we go straight? Yeah. Let's go straight. Stay on the flats here. Whew. Nice job with that workout today, guys. I know that's tough, especially towards the end there. Start to burn. How did it feel for you, Morgan? Do you Ooh, feel you like know, you could hold your speed? I feel like I hold my speed okay, but those last two, the four minute and the five minute, were a little tough to come back from. So, I felt it, guys. I did. Whew. Shaking out those arms a little bit there. <sighs> Big deep breaths, trying to bring that heart rate down. it in start to back off just a little bit more even gradual slow down Feel for you. Oh, that was good. That was good, Morgan. Yeah. That was uh, the three and the four minutes started to feel a little bit longer. Yeah. It's amazing how much uh, an additional minute can feel in the running. All right, another minute in. Slow it down even more. Yeah, let's go left. Oh, that breeze feels good. Oh. I can only wish that it's this sunny and beautiful wherever you're watching this from. But if not, we're sending all of the warm, positive vibes. Warm thoughts your way. Warm thoughts. <laughs> Just above a walk at this point. Still think about those light, quick feet, even mm -hmm. though we're running slow. Morgan's doing a good job of not letting her not form get sloppy or fall apart. Or anything like this. I still I'm nice and tall through the chest, still driving those elbows. I'm just going at a slower pace.
Let's go up. Let's go up by the flowers. Yeah. Let's get some scenery in here in our cool down. <clears throat> well, I hope you guys enjoyed riding with me as much as I enjoyed riding with all of you today. You're feeling good. One more minute. Let's just actually bring this down to a walk now. Oh yeah. We start to get some big stretches up overhead. Stretch out those arms. Lengthening your fingers. Give that nice stretch to the back there. Get some big arm swings in here. Oh yeah. And our first some there. Oh. I always tend to get a little tense up in my shoulders if I don't keep reminding myself to relax. So I always want to make sure I stretch that out, shake out my arms, so that I'm not carrying that tension in with me for the rest of the day, right? Running is supposed to relieve stress, not create it, so I want to make sure that we're doing that. And we are finishing up that warm up. Great job, guys. Hope you guys are nice and cooled down a little bit there, but we don't want to just jog on our cool down. I want you guys to get a full body cool down, nice stretches there. So go ahead, click over here. I got a whole other video for you on how to cool down properly. So you guys are ready to go and prep for your next run. Great job today. I am, you are, I, somebody is gonna be doing. Oh, hey baby. Hi. No, so happy. So happy.